Michele Ruffinelli from Los Angeles, California, believes she has the world's biggest hips, measuring a staggering eight feet in circumference. I love my curves, I love my hips, I love my attributes. <laughs> I love being unique. Mikkel says her figure is down to genetics rather than her diet. The gene of big hips runs in my family. And here's a picture of my beautiful mom. You can really see where I get my shapely loveliness from. <laughs> I didn't start gaining weight until just before I had my son. With every child came more hips, and I have had four kids. So I've gotten a little wider, wider, wider each child. Now Mikkel's hips are so big, she attracts attention you know, everywhere she goes. Go. Some people have thought I've had implants. I've been asked, is it real? I get that a lot. French, Japanese, French, Japanese. I mean, there's no way it's actually real. Like, I mean, how do you gain that much weight in your ass and you don't have it on your arms? I would never want to be with a girl like that, no. I can't do it. Some of the reactions I've gotten from men and women, you know, both sides, they laugh, they'll point, they'll whisper. I've gotten videos recorded of me. Anywhere I go, someone's going to take out their camera phone or a camera. I probably had hundreds of pictures taken of me no matter where I've gone. <laughs> Mikkel's unique dimensions also pose difficulties at home, where her 99-inch hips barely fit through doorways and showering is a challenge. Over in to the shower, lift up the other leg, try not to fall, and I'm in. If I try to close it this way, I can't do it. <laughs> to keep in shape, Mikkel exercises Hi, with her three daughters. How's school? Good. Well, help mommy up. One, two, three, go. Very good. All right. Okay. <laughs> when I don't get a chance to go do my exercise, I'm implementing doing my, my in my family time with my kids, I'll dance with them on the week. So <laughs> that's fun. But despite Mikkel's relaxed attitude, her family have mixed feelings about her size. I'm tired. That's enough. <laughs> okay, put them away. I don't mind following her footsteps, but I don't really want to because I see how her struggle is and if she stands up for a certain amount of time she starts to hurt and it kind of hurts me to see her struggle. <laughs> it ain't working. Oh, wait, wait, wait. oh my god. She really this doesn't is all you like uh-uh no Reggie don't yeah, do that. Like that. Get nice on. <laughs> yeah, get off. <laughs> While Mikkel's extreme proportions divide opinion in some, she's found true love with husband Reggie. A lot of people say they don't believe in love at first sight. However, that's how it was for me. She had a sweet disposition about her that really attracted me to her. I like to tell people all the time, I have a license to work with heavy equipment. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there we go. I think it's feminine to have curves. It's very womanly. It, it makes us beautiful. I'd rather be this size and happy with me loving me than to be skinny that size and be unhappy 